The public may expect lower prices of rice by July following the reduction of tariff on imported rice. Here's the report. Several days after the government announced rice tariff cut, prices of rice are expected to drop to as low as 40 pesos per kilo from 45 pesos currently. But this could be lower even further to 29 pesos in Kadiwa stores by August and in markets by next year. We are anticipating that um, uh, NIA can bring to the table literally uh, 29, 29 pesos, uh, 29 pesos no? uh, by August. No? So this is all within, uh, no, within the near term, so to speak. No? So the effect will soon be felt. Hindi to plan, hindi to drawing. Despite this, some agriculture groups continue to oppose the tariff cut on imported rice. Sinag for one says they were not consulted about the new policy. They also believe that this won't benefit local farmers as it will result in lower farm gate price. Dahil po sa matinding pagkalugin na in-expect ng ating mga magpapalay, baka marami pong hindi na magtatanim muna. Uh, there is an estimate initially of maybe as much as kalahating milyong hektarya po ang apektado po dito. But Romualdez explained that the government will continue to support our farmers. Naintindi natin mga concerns ng PRISEM, ng SINA, yung mga farmers group. But we also have to realize na yung concerns din ng over 100 million Pilipinos na nangangailangan na talagang uh, maayos na kalidad na bigas the Agriculture Department also maintains that the new tariff policy is necessary. Well, it's really not anti-farmer, no? but uh, now kasi sobrang taas talaga ng presyo ng bigas sa mundo. Eh. So we, we have to really do this para naman yung consumer naman matulungan uh, at uh, bumaba in general ang presyo ng bigas you know, for, for the moment.